blessed man does not sit in the seat of the scoffer. There's a progression in here that finds its fulfillment in this final phrase. Walking in the counsel of the ungodly leads to standing in their path, which culminates in sitting in the scoffer's chair. What does it mean uh, to sit in the scoffer's seat? To scoff means to speak to someone or about something in a scornfully derisive or mocking way. Scoffers are those that openly rebel against God's law. They mock God's holiness. Matthew Henry explains that the seat of the scoffer belongs to those that are secure in their wickedness and please themselves with seeredness of their own conscience. This psalm is showing us how little by little men are induced to turn from the right path. The blessed man doesn't sit in the seat because he knows that listening and associating with the wicked will in due time lead to thinking and acting like the wicked. He knows that big sins have small beginnings. Brethren, do not make peace with small sins. They never stay small. They always grow. Lawlessness leads to more lawlessness. Confess your sins to God and to each other often. Do not let the counsel of the ungodly establish a beachhead in your heart. 